From coast to coast, water restrictions are in place as drought conditions worsen, affecting tens of millions of people. Now, while we specifically aren't struggling with drought in our area, you can still take some steps to conserve water and cut down on your bill. Five on your side's Keely Arthur and Consumer Reports shares how. Do you know where your water comes from? In Raleigh, the majority of drinking water comes from the Falls Lake Reservoir, located in northern Wake County, and is treated at the Johnson Water Treatment Plant. Right now, it has 93% of its supply. That's pretty good. But why not try cutting down on water to cut down on your bill? The EPA says outdoor watering accounts for almost 30% of household water. So think about replacing some grass with mulch, ground cover, or long ornamental grasses that uses far less water. Instead of rinsing your driveway or deck, sweep it or use an electric leaf blower and wash your car with a bucket of water instead of a running hose. Nearly 20% of indoor residential water use flows from the shower. A standard shower head releases 2.5 gallons of water a minute. Consumer Reports says that replacing it with a low flow water sensor approved head that uses two gallons per minute or less can save 2,700 gallons a year. Save even more by limiting showers to under five minutes and turn off the water when shaving or brushing your teeth. And in the kitchen, when you're washing your dishes, let your pots and pans just soak instead of scrubbing them under running water. And when you need a cold drink of water, just fill up a pitcher instead of running your sink every time you need a glass. Plus, save water in the laundry room. If you have an HE washer, use a detergent for an HE machine. Regular detergents will create a lot of suds and will force an HE washer to use more water to get that soap out. Keely Arthur, five on your side.